Picture this, a city that is known for its ancient temples, traditional wooden houses, and geisha-clad in kimono, suddenly transforms into a paradise of pink. This is Kyoto during the cherry blossom season. Kyoto, a city steeped in history and tradition, becomes a spectacle of natural beauty during the cherry blossom season. It's a time when the ancient city, known for its time-honored traditions and well-preserved architecture, undergoes a breathtaking transformation. As winter fades, the cherry trees, or sakura as they're known in Japan, start to bloom. They blanket the city in a delicate canopy of pink, creating an ethereal atmosphere that captures the heart and soul. The cherry blossom season, or hanami, is a significant event in Kyoto. It's not just about the beauty of the blossoms, but also a cultural celebration deeply rooted in Japanese tradition. The cherry blossom season in Kyoto is a time of renewal and reflection. It's a period when the city and its people pause to appreciate the transient beauty of nature, a concept deeply ingrained in Japanese culture. The cherry blossoms in all their fleeting glory serve as a reminder of the impermanence in the changing seasons of life. During this season, the city is awash with shades of pink and white. The ancient temples and shrines are adorned with these delicate blossoms, creating a stunning contrast against the historic architecture. The narrow lanes of the traditional districts lined with wooden machia houses are transformed into picturesque walkways. The sight of geishas in their colorful kimonos walking under the cherry blossom trees adds a touch of elegance and allure to the scene. As the blossoms fall, they cover the city like a soft pink snow, creating a magical ambiance that is both enchanting and captivating. This awe-inspiring spectacle draws visitors from around the world, eager to experience this unique blend of natural beauty and cultural heritage. So, are you ready for this mesmerizing journey? Let's delve into the magic of Kyoto's cherry blossom season. Join us as we guide you through this magical journey of Kyoto's cherry blossom season. Our journey begins with the first bloom, a sight that signals the start of the cherry blossom season. It is a moment of anticipation, a whisper of the spectacle that is about to unfold. The cherry trees, or sakura, have been patiently awaiting this moment through the cold winter months. And now, as the first hint of spring graces Kyoto, the buds start to swell. The first bloom is a delicate thing, a pink petal emerging shyly from the bud. It's a spectacle that breathes new life into the city, a sign that the cherry blossom season has begun. The gardens, parks, and temples around Kyoto, known for their collection of cherry trees, become the canvas for this nature's artistry. One of Kyoto's most cherished gardens, the Maruyama Park, sees its cherry trees waking up from their winter slumber. The first blooms sprinkle the trees, creating a mesmerizing contrast against the deep green of the leaves and the clear blue of the sky. It is a sight that never fails to inspire awe and wonder. The cultural importance of the first bloom cannot be overstated. It signifies a time of renewal and hope. A theme deeply ingrained in Japanese culture, the first bloom is often seen as an embodiment of mono no aware, a concept that appreciates the beauty of impermanence. It reminds us to cherish each moment for like the cherry blossoms, it is fleeting and precious. In Kyoto, the first bloom is a communal event, a shared experience that brings people together. It's a time when families, friends, and even strangers gather under the blossoming trees to celebrate the beauty of life. It's a tradition known as hanami, which literally translates to flower viewing. As the first bloom unfolds, the city prepares for a spectacle that brings joy to everyone who witnesses it. The anticipation builds as each day brings more blooms, each one more beautiful and vibrant than the last. The cherry blossom season is here, and with it the promise of unforgettable memories and magical experiences. As days pass, the city transforms into a canvas of pink with cherry blossoms reaching their peak bloom. The full bloom is a spectacle that captivates all who witness it turning everyday scenes into masterpieces of nature's artistry. Streets, parks, and riversides are awash with soft, delicate hues, creating a breathtaking panorama that's quintessentially Kyoto. The gardens, oh the gardens, they are the most enchanting during this time. The Imperial Palace Garden, Maruyama Park, and the Philosopher's Path to name a few are all at their most splendid. Each tree, each branch, each blossom seems to tell a story, a silent sonnet of spring and the transient beauty of life. Every corner of the city is a vista of blossoms, a sea of pink and white that stretches as far as the eye can see. 
The sakura petals fluttering in the breeze add a poetic charm to the cityscape, making it feel as if one is walking in a dream or a beautifully illustrated storybook. But the full bloom isn't just about the visual spectacle. It's also a time of cultural celebration. The hanami parties, the picnics under the cherry blossom trees, are a tradition dating back centuries. Families, friends, and even strangers come together, sharing food, laughter, and the joy of the season. It's a time when the sense of community is at its strongest, a testament to the unifying power of nature's beauty. Then, there's the Yozakura, the night viewing of the blossoms. Lanterns are lit, casting a magical glow on the blossoms and turning the gardens into ethereal realms of light and shadow. The city, adorned in its nocturnal Sakura attire, presents a different kind of beauty, one that's mystical and captivating. The full bloom is a sight to behold, a moment that epitomizes the beauty of nature and the culture of Kyoto. It's a celebration of life, a testament to the fleeting beauty of existence. It's a season that reminds us to stop, observe, and appreciate the world around us, to find joy in the simple and the transient. A season that, much like the cherry blossoms themselves, is beautiful because it is ephemeral. As the cherry blossom season comes to an end, the late bloomers take the stage, extending the magical experience. These late bloomers, often overlooked, are the ones that make the season last a little longer, a final act in the beautiful performance that is the cherry blossom season in Kyoto. The late bloom often occurs in the higher altitudes of Kyoto, where the cooler temperatures delay the blossoming of the cherry trees. In these areas, the cherry blossoms burst forth in their full glory when the rest of Kyoto has started to see the petals fall. Places such as the Kuramadera Temple and the Ohara District are famous for their late-blooming cherry trees. Here, the blossoms create a soft pink canopy, transforming these areas into magical landscapes. The late bloom is more than just a delay in nature's schedule. It is a gentle reminder that beauty does not adhere to a strict timeline. It blooms when it is ready, adding to the charm of the cherry blossom season. The late bloom extends the cherry blossom season, providing more opportunities for locals and visitors to immerse themselves in the cultural activities linked to this time. Tea ceremonies under the cherry trees, picnics in the parks, and strolls along the philosopher's path continue, with the late bloomers serving as the backdrop. The late bloomers have a special place in Japanese culture. They symbolize resilience and the ability to shine even when others have faded away. They are a testament to the beauty of individuality and the power of persistence. As the late bloomers take center stage, they provide a beautiful closure to the cherry blossom season. They are the final bow, the last encore, a poignant reminder of the fleeting beauty of the cherry blossoms. And as the petals of the late bloomers start to fall, they pave the way for the onset of summer, leaving behind memories of a magical cherry blossom season in Kyoto. The late bloomers, in their own way, provide a beautiful closure to the cherry blossom season. When the sun sets, the city lights up, offering a different perspective of the cherry blossoms. As the day transitions into night, Kyoto takes on a different persona. The city, bathed in soft moonlight and twinkling city lights, becomes a stage for the cherry blossoms to shine. This is the time for Yozakura, the night viewing of cherry blossoms, a tradition as old as the bloom itself. In gardens and parks across Kyoto, the cherry trees are illuminated, their delicate blossoms glowing against the dark sky. The Maruyama Park, the Kiyomizu Dera Temple, and the Nijo Castle are among the many places where this enchanting spectacle can be witnessed. Each location, with its unique landscape and history, offers a distinct backdrop to the glowing cherry blossoms, making the experience all the more mesmerizing. Underneath the moonlight, the cherry blossoms take on a dreamy, ethereal quality. The pale pink petals bathed in soft silver light seem to shimmer, creating a landscape that seems to have been plucked from a fairy tale. The reflection of the blossoms in the still waters of the garden ponds adds an extra layer of magic to the scene. But Yozakura is more than just a visual feast. It is deeply rooted in Japanese culture and tradition. It is a time for contemplation and appreciation, a time to take a moment from the fast-paced life and immerse oneself in the beauty of nature. The night viewing of cherry blossoms is an embodiment of mono no aware, a Japanese concept that appreciates the beauty of ephemeral things. Yozakura is also a time for community and celebration. 
friends and families gather under the cherry blossoms. Sharing food, stories, and laughter, the air is filled with a sense of camaraderie and joy, making the experience all the more memorable. Night viewing of cherry blossoms is a magical experience, a spectacle that adds a touch of mystery and romance to the cherry blossom season. So as the night falls and the cherry blossoms light up, Kyoto transforms into a city of magic and wonder. And you, dear wanderer, are invited to be a part of this enchanting spectacle. Kyoto's cherry blossom season is a magical journey, a spectacle that brings joy to everyone who witnesses it. We've embarked on a mesmerizing journey together, from the first shy blooms peeping out to herald the arrival of spring, to the full bloom's grand spectacle, a symphony of pink and white. The late bloomers too held their own charm, proving that beauty indeed is worth the wait. And who could forget the ethereal beauty of the night viewing where the cherry blossoms gleamed under the moonlight, creating an unforgettable sight. This journey through Kyoto's cherry blossom season is more than just a visual feast. It's a reminder to appreciate the fleeting beauty of nature, to savor every moment, and to embrace the change of seasons with grace and joy. If you enjoyed this magical journey through Kyoto's cherry blossom season, please like this video and subscribe to our channel for more such enchanting experiences. Until next time, keep exploring and keep cherishing the beauty of nature.